weren't for the high school girls hoops tonight over at Romano Gym, it was all eyes on both semifinal games in the Section 7 Single A Tournament. Our first game featured the first seed in South Cromwell, right, and the second seed in the North, the Wolves from Ely. We start in the second half with the Wolves up by four. Hannah Penke shakes off the defender and lets the triple fly from downtown. Nothing but net as Ely extends their lead. But the Cardinals would start to catch fire beyond the arc as well. Ball finds its way to senior Marissa Dahl, who launches from there. And that tray ball cuts the lead to five. Next possession for Cromwell from the same spot on the court. Senior Maya Groner, she nails the triple from long range as the deficit is now two. And a few plays later, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Sienna Anderson passes it off to senior Emily Olsick, and the Cardinals are on fire. They take the lead on that three-pointer. Cardinals would rally to complete the second half, come back and take the win, 57-51, advancing to play the winner of our second semifinal game of the night. And that game featured the top-seeded Rangers from Mountain Iron Buell and the second-seeded Panthers from South Range. If you haven't already had the pleasure, let me introduce you to Ranger senior Jordan Zubich. She drives to the paint and throws a sweet dish to Gabby Lara, who lays it in. MIB goes up early. A couple possessions later, Zubich this time taking around the defense, hitting the brakes and pulling up for the two-point J. Rangers stretch their lead to eight now. But halfway through the first half, Gabby Lara sets up guess who? Zubich down low for the layup, up the paint, and she was all over that court tonight. Now the Rangers up by double digits. Time to take a trip downtown. Eighth grader Isabel with a, with a triple from deep. MIB would continue to roll over Southridge as they win 81 to 36. Also advancing to Section 7A finals against Cromwell Wright. Cardinals, that game is on Friday at 6 p.m. from the Gymnasium. So to come, we were